Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Sammy Fryer, licensed realtor in the state of South Carolina, and this is this week's housing market report for the city of Florence for the week of June the 17th, 2024. And I'm thinking about switching these over to a live stream format sooner than later. We'll see how that goes, but if we do, they will still be released at the same time, ideally. Tuesdays at 7 p.m. With that being said, let's jump right into this. And with that said, median list prices, aka home prices, are continuing a steep and sharp incline. I saw an article somewhere, a headline uh, a couple days ago, maybe it was yesterday, that said, don't be fooled by recent headlines. Home prices are not coming down. Well, that's true. I, I haven't seen those headlines. I don't know what that article was referring to. I didn't click it. I just saw it. But Spot on for them, home prices are increasing. They're not decreasing. In fact, we're going to look at something in a minute. Home prices are at their highest point they've been at in five years, and they're climbing. Home prices are not coming down. They're going up. Good news for you sellers, especially in our market here in Florence, as the average days on market is continuing to slowly decline since the beginning of February. Not a drastic decline but the average days on market has dropped. And so that's pretty significant. And we would really expect that to continue to be the case as we start to push in to the summer through August, moving into October. So what about inventory? Inventory is also climbing since February. Again, inventory is climbing. So inventory is going up. Average days on market is going down and the median list prices are increasing dramatically the whole time. So the big question we've talked about a lot this year so far is, but how many of them are decreasing? Well, that is the biggest news. The number of properties experiencing a price decrease is decreasing. And so in this case, I actually wanna look at the seven day average. Normally we look at the 90 day average on these reports. By the way, you can receive these reports for free to your inbox weekly. All you gotta do is just reach out and let me know that you wanna receive them, send me your email address and I'll get them over to you. They cost you nothing. And you can look at any zip code in the United States, any city in the United States. We see a slight decrease on the 90 day average, but I wanna look at the seven day average. Look at this sharp decline over the last four weeks since May the 24th, a sharp decline over the last few weeks in properties with a price decrease. The reason I wanna point this out is because I have someone that I've been working with out of state for a while that asked me a question and said, you know, do I have good opportunity to buy a property at less than its asking price? And the answer is right now, no, not really. Unless a home is overpriced and pretty significantly so, then you can expect to pay at or very close to the asking price for that property. Particularly over the last few weeks, you see this sharp decrease in the number of properties with a price decrease. And let's point out one more thing and let's just say what it means for our market. And it's really good news for you sellers right now. The price per square foot right now on a 90 day average of $141 per for Florence, South Carolina, almost equal to where it was this time a year ago. But the point is that this number is all time high and significantly higher than the price per square foot for homes anywhere in the last five years. So homes are more expensive now than they've ever been. Median list prices are increasing. Homes are being sold at a declining rate of the average days on market, meaning that they're selling faster and sellers are getting their asking price more and more frequently. The seven day average for this last week has dipped below that target average of 30%. So home prices are going up inventory is going up and the homes are selling relatively quickly or quicker. And you can see that since mid-March, our market action index has just gotten higher and higher and higher in the seller's advantage. So what does this all mean? Well, I'll tell you what it means. What it means is that now is a really good time to list and sell your home. We've been talking about it for a couple of weeks now. If you're looking to sell in Florence, now is the time to consult with a realtor get a home valuation. We can give you a free home valuation. All contact information is down in the description of this video. Get an idea of where your home is at and start making your preparations and plans because now is the time to get that home listed on the market and get it sold for top dollar. While everybody's giving out opinions about this and that, and this and that, and the Federal Reserve and all these things, we're looking at what the data tells us. And so just to recap, median list prices are going up. More and more expensive homes entering the market. They're sitting on the market for an average of lesser and lesser days with each week that passes. Less and less of those homes are having to decrease their price to get them sold. And more and more people are realizing these things and putting their homes up for sale 
thereby increasing the inventory. So if you're on the fence about selling and you're watching these market reports, particularly this one right now this evening, now's the time to get off the fence. Give us a call today. Let's get you a complimentary home valuation. Find out the worth of your home. Take a look at everything and look at what makes the most sense for you and your particular situation. But if everything lines up, now's the time to get that house listed on the open market and get it sold if you want to yield the max value for it. The next 90 days are gonna be prime for the real estate market for you as a seller. All right, and so I hope you find this information helpful. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up. If you wanna stay abreast of these future market updates that come out weekly and or any of the other content that we do on this channel, hit the subscribe button down below so that you can be notified of future videos. Again, all of our contact information is down in the video description. Mine and our office reach out to us today and we would love to help you in your home selling or buying transaction. I don't know when we're gonna convert these to live. Could be as early as next week. In the meantime, I look forward to hearing from y'all. I wish y'all all the best in your real estate endeavors and y'all take care and we'll see you on the next one.